Hey Warriors, it's been a crazy few weeks and even though we're social distancing right now, the execs wanted to check in and give you some tips on how to look after yourself and others. Looking after yourself and others right now is about more than just keeping our distance to prevent the spread of COVID-19. We also need to be mindful about the spread of hate and racism online. This pandemic is a scary time for all of us, but that's never an excuse to use your own fear as a reason to be racist or xenophobic towards these stations. Unlike people, COVID-19 does not discriminate on the basis of race or ethnicity. Please use this time to not only protect yourself and those you care about, but look to the more vulnerable folks in your community and see what you can do to support them. It's important that as a community, we continue to stand together and support one another. If you or someone you know has experienced acts of racism or xenophobia that you would like to discuss or report, please reach out to our new racialized service, RAISE. If you're feeling alone on campus or anxious about the current situation, so are many other students. And that's why there's services that continue to offer to provide those key supports when you need them. Reach out to UW Mates at mates at wusa.ca to schedule a peer support session, or contact the Empower Me Student Assistance Program for 24 7 365 mental health support. In this ever changing situation, don't forget to prioritize your own health, both mental and physical. When you're cooped up at home and you have more time in your hands, it can be tempting to try and keep updated with the constant stream of news and updates, or to scroll endlessly through social media. Please remember to take breaks. For example, I downloaded an app on my phone that lets me grow a forest while I'm not using it. The news will always be there, and if you spend a few hours or a day away from updates, you're not going to miss out. Most of us haven't taken all of our courses online before. And so if you're wondering what that feels like for you, you're in that same boat with a lot of other students. So treat it like a normal course, like you would on campus. Study hard, work hard, put in a regular fixed schedule for it. And if you're running into issues, well, the SSO's got great resources for online learning and how to learn effectively through online courses. Keeping a routine of schoolwork and making food and keeping yourself healthy is going to be important. But it's also important to structure in breaks for hobbies as well. And that doesn't necessarily mean going out and buying power tools and taking up carpentry. It can be as simple as reading or writing or taking up TikTok. For those of us lucky enough to be able to stay home, it's important that we take it easy on ourselves. With everything going on, you might feel like you're not being productive with all of your time off, but don't feel discouraged. There's a lot going on in the world right now that'll make it difficult to focus or find motivation to get things done. You're not alone in this. Instead of setting high expectations for yourself right off the bat, let yourself come to terms with the new world that we're living in. If that means spending a couple days catching up on sleep and binging Netflix, that's okay. These are difficult times. When you feel up to it, try taking breaks to keep your body moving. You could try going on a walk or even following along with UW Athletics programs online. And of course, we want to continue taking this crisis seriously. Keeping your distance from others is going to be key to preventing further spread of COVID-19. This is a crisis that affects not just us, but our families, our communities, and our friends. So we hope that you can be part of the solution by continuing to keep your distance and staying safe. We'll be keeping you updated on changes in the situation and how they affect you as students, but rest assured that we'll also keep advocating on your behalf. If you have any questions or concerns, please reach out to me at prez.wusa.ca or see our website at wusa.ca slash COVID-19. You can stay engaged with the WUSA community as well. Follow us at your WUSA. Check in with us from time to time, tag us in a post, or send us a message. Whether you're on or off campus, we're still here to support you.